a sheep in the house. You're gonna dance like that? Yes. Okay. The girls and I are hitting up the children's museum. I think Kira smeared some potatoes in her hair because it's so greasy. <laughs> you wanna put on a cape? No. Cake. No, cape. Not cake. Cape. <laughs> And then pull that lever. Pull like this. Whoa! You watch it go down. Wanna do it again? <laughs> I am in the same spot. Daddy's without the Juliana. Am I sick? 
I'm just winding down and yeah we've been back for a few days since our long trip going to California and then to DC and we haven't really gotten back into routine yet it's just been so crazy with the girls because I'm pretty sure they had separation anxiety with especially me being gone for so long that was the longest I've ever been away from them so anytime I step out of the room without giving them a heads up like they freak out and they always want to be held by me like especially me thankfully I noticed that the girls were starting to gravitate towards Benji again but it's been like it's been crazy I had no time to focus on anything else other than the girls next coming week I hope I can get back on to videos for its mommy's life and even for its Judy time like, I have a video that I'm almost on editing but I have no time to edit it because all of my extra time goes into the vlogs so it's just been so crazy Benji and I have been getting we've just been bickering a lot this morning I was like really upset at him I told him not to even come to the children's museum yeah and he just like shows up unexpectedly and like when he does stuff like that I'm just it's so sweet so anyways um things are good Benji and I talked and hot water's ready we're better now and we just needed to hash things out so when we were driving back from the children's museum there's like this marina on the way back home it was sprinkling and i saw this older couple walking on the marina with their two little dogs and the guy was so sweet like he was holding the the huge umbrella for his wife and himself then i thought about benji and i i'm not gonna cry this and I'm crying over stuff like this but and then I thought about Benji and I and how in 50 years we are all that we're gonna have you know I mean I'm not saying that our kids are gonna abandon us but our kids are gonna have their lives they're gonna create their own families and really in the end in the day-to-day -day life it's gonna be Benji and I and we really need a like work hard on our relationship i think we've been bickering like over the past two days and it's so not even worth it like to have to be angry over the smallest things like just we just need to try to fix it right away i want to be that old couple walking in the rain with our two little dogs like i want that to be us and if you're fighting with your spouse right now think to yourself is it really worth it did you pick your battles? Talk it out because it like it's been really sucky for the two of us. I'm gonna drive this little Miata. <laughs> I finally I have the guts to drive it. It's been a while since I've driven manual. It's been since college. Put on your seatbelt. Don't worry, I did right when I got in. Make sure you take off your safety. I know. Smooth, smooth, smooth. I think she's doing pretty good, all things considered. Oh my gosh, I'm like getting anxiety. I always default back to neutral. I never default to first. Is that weird? Oh yeah, no. That's, that's what I was I taught. Think that's, I think that's smart. I mean, I guess it's just all depending on how you want to drive. Mazda, don't you worry. We're going to take care of your ride. In the back roads. In the back roads. Oh no, this is like the main road. No, it's not the main road. We still got one more main road to go brake before the turn and then you accelerate okay, out. Okay, so what we're going to do, honey, I'm not going to go on this main road. Uh -huh. I'm going to go straight and then you take, you take over. Really? You don't want to go? No, I don't. I'm not down for the thrill. Unless it's in... So I tie up my wrapper for my yeah. chopsticks so that I have something to rest my chopsticks on. Yet. <laughs> on Facebook, they said you snap this thing off and then that's what becomes it. So I've never done that, Can so you let's snap see. It? Well, let's see. Okay, careful now. I don't think this is working. It just don't seem right. Yeah, I don't think it's meant to do that, honey. Well, that maybe it's a sense. specific brand. You 
know why it's not that? What? Because even if you could snap it off, that's the tiniest little thing. Facebook. You're wrong, Facebook. Facebook. Oh, but the Chinese takeout boxes turn into plates. I've seen that. I need to give up. Quick stop to the grocery store to pick up some essentials, like some wheat bread, sweet chili sauce, and sriracha. And of course, Benji is trying to fulfill his kid dream, which he has never, like I you know the- I did once. Have you? I did on the vlog, yeah. It was after one of a date or something like that. I did it. An Instagram post to show it. Oh. If you can find that Instagram post and put it in the comments. Okay, they don't even know what it is. You know that scene in Home Alone? He is in the hotel room and he orders a sundae, but it's huge. That's like Benji's dream. If he could have it every night, he'd be so happy. Uh, what are you looking for? Well, I was looking for evaporated milk or condensed milk. I forget which one you use. I guess I could look it up. Condensed milk, honey. Is it condensed milk? Yeah. It's like the thicker. Let's see what ice cream he chooses. You want to bet that it's all natural? Nice boote. Say what? It came out with white chocolate bunnies? Oh my goodness. Too bad they don't have the smaller ones. I love white chocolate. Holy cow, is this for real? Oh, it's not, it's not a candy bar. <laughs> what are you watching? No, I'm gonna give him back. Puppets. Hey! Puppets. Puppets. Naked. You're not naked. <laughs> We're gonna go. You're gonna take a bath anyways. Yeah, did you finish your cookie? Is it yummy? Did you say thank you? Thank you, mommy. Thank you, mommy. You're welcome. What's going on here? I told you. What? <laughs> Because she said, Mama's gonna smell me. And I said, Yeah, she's gonna say you're bango. Uh -huh, yeah. How do you say smells good in Tagalog? I just taught you. Say it. Mabango. Bango. Say bango. Whipped cream, chocolate sauce. <clears throat> I'm on Snapchat. Do I get to have more or is that it? Yeah, I have one more. <laughs> Come here. 